Hi guys, welcome back to Angel Art. I'm Gretchen. Thank you for meeting me here today again. I've had the flu this past week, so my voice is still kind of lost somewhere. But anyway, maybe you've noticed my setup is different. Because it's time to do this cool lampshade. I tested it a few weeks ago and I didn't like it, so I removed it all, cleaned it. And I want to try it one more time. And hoping I'm going to like it this time, okay? The lampshade I bought at Ikea, it's more than a year ago already. But it was like, I think it was 5 euros here in the, in the Netherlands. So it's, it's not an expensive lampshade. It's fully plastic. I did close off this hole. Because I don't want the paint to run to the inside. And that's what you're looking at at the moment. It's just a piece of carton. I have my lampshade on four little shot glasses and that's on a 30 by 30 centimeter canvas. I usually don't tape off the sides what I did this time but the reason I'm doing that is because I don't want the paint to run off before because I hope, I'm hoping Fingers crossed. I'm hoping I'm gonna like the pattern on the canvas. I'm only using three colors this time. I have Prussian blue from Amsterdam. This is copper from Panduro. And I'm also not using white, I'm using pearl white, all right? Whenever you pour on something that's gonna keep on dripping, you really need thick paint, all right? And I can show you my consistency that it's really leaving a trace. So yeah, my paints are very thick, guys. You can see that. Let's just start, all right, because I'm anxious for this one, okay? I also have four stands in the back. So I can remove the lampshade and put her on that. Okay, let's fill this one guys. Prussian, copper and pearl white. This color is so beautiful, guys. Russian blue. Okay, that should be enough right for now. Colors are gorgeous already, but <laughs> let me go, okay? I'm gonna come on this side, guys, because I want to be able to see what I'm doing. I actually would like something like little ring pores on this side.
ください。Pull the paint down, then it's going to get covered as well. Okay, that's pretty nice. It's going to get covered anyway. I really need to wet it. It's mostly covered, only some spots, like this piece. Oh, it's starting to come down here, right? Wow. Camera just stopped recording again. I have a new system and it's the second time this happens in a short time to me. But let me explain what I did. I did the lampshade, I'm going to show you that, I'm going to go in for the close-up. And I did not like the pattern that came out, so I did a ring pour in the middle. And actually wrecked it three times, you can see that. And then I just tilted it until I did like it. And I must say, I was telling you that, okay? I think this one is gorgeous. It's so different that I'm loving it because all these lines in the back and then you do this gorgeous little wreck ring pour in the middle. It, I didn't want it to be perfectly round. That's why I moved with it so that it's more organic-y like. I explained so much and the camera didn't record so I'm sorry guys. Promise this is not gonna happen again. Or I'm gonna just start filming from the beginning again, all right? But as you can see, these were all the drips from the lampshade. And that didn't really leave a great pattern. I left, left it go all to the middle. I did a ring pour in the same three colors, the Prussian blue. The pearl white and uh, copper. This is the ring pour I did just on top of it. And I took a skewer with the lines that were already there. I made three. I wrecked it at three places like this. And then I just started to move with it, okay? In a way it looks like it's some planet going through space. Another way it reminds me of some kind of flower. It's a crazy flower, right? But hey, let me take you in for the close up. Loving these colors, guys, and the shine and the gloss. It's gorgeous. I just had to mix a little bit more of that Prussian blue. That's why the center has so many air bubbles and specks. 
I'm really curious to see how these are gonna dry. I'm hoping that lamp lampshade, because it's pretty dark and I wanted it pretty dark. I'm really hoping it's gonna give a little more light. <laughs> I'm gonna put in a LED light, guys, so it's not gonna be uh, hot. I hope that you like this video. And if you did, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button and that notification bell so we can meet each other every week. Thank you for being here and greetings from the Netherlands.